What's up, everybody? How's it going? I'm Tactical Dreamer or Chris Barlett, whatever you want to call me. Welcome to the stream. We're playing Assassin's Creed Valhalla today. I haven't played since last Saturday when I did the four hours on stream. I'm glad they have game time on here, by the way. They've had it on all of the big RPG Assassin's Creeds, which I appreciate. <clears throat> uh, let's unmute the game. Probably a good idea. So we're about ten and a half hours in, but we've only been in England for like maybe two or three tops. Uh, we're just working on like some raids, grabbing lots of stuff as we go. Starting to feel kind of overwhelmed by the number of icons everywhere. Uh, these raids are way above our power level, but there was one more we could hit that was not above our power level, which is over there. So that's where I want to head, but I want to check out this guy first. Unveiled. Junta. Son of Junta. Okay. Assassinate the Baldrick. So this, the like, knight with the cross helmet. Uh, killing him just, like, reveals the location of one of the others, I believe. One of the, like, actual order of ancients. I think that's correct. Feel free to correct me if I'm wrong. Also, I should point out, um, sub-goal. We're at 8 out of 30. So we need 22 more in, what is it, 11 days? So two per day. Wow, that's, uh, seems unlikely, but I hope we can pull through. Because it would be really fun to do that Twitch thing stream. This is the last time that I'm going to be able to use that as a goal. I can still do, like, YouTube karaoke, but I feel like that's going to get me in even more uh, DMCA trouble. Troll cursed corruption. At least doing it here, maybe I would just, like, do it on YouTube. But that's weird, because I don't normally stream on YouTube, you know? Oh, hello. What's this? This area is cursed. Find and destroy the source. Oh, weird. Am I taking damage? No. Oh, that's crazy. Controller is vibrating harshly there. Oh, it must be down here. Uh, let's see if I can figure out how to play this game, guys. <clears throat> I've been switching between a lot of third-person games lately, so I do not remember the controls. I remember. This has got to be where the curse is. Ooh, creepy shit happening down here, that's for sure. Let's say no. Woden, I beseech thee. Here I craft these cursed poles and turn them toward the Danes. <laughs> Excuse me. May their eyes rot in sight of them. May their lungs burn at the smell of them. May their bowels void at the thought of them. Send them sailing back over the seas to their devil-cursed lands. Destroyed. Interesting. Is there anything else down here? Okay, yeah, you can't do the scan thing, that's right. <clears throat> it's funny, my first instinct uh, as I was coming up to that tree was to push in the right stick uh, to pull out my camera and examine it like bug snacks. I'm playing a lot of bug snacks. Like the game. Like that game a lot. I'm almost done with it. I've been working on getting the platinum as I go too, so it's taking quite a bit of time, but very close. I want to get a sneak on this guy, so I don't really want to call my horse. Oh, he's pretty far though. I should probably call my horse. Mystery over here, though. Uh, I'm just gonna keep getting distracted. I gotta focus one thing at a time. For now, that one thing's gonna be this guy who's freaking out. Uh, 
it's going too far down. I got his attention. Oh boy. Okay, never mind. He's way too powerful for me. You can see he's got a big red symbol. It's not a red death mark, but like the fact that a headshot on him does nothing uh, tells me I don't want to do that. Let's just go back to that mystery we saw earlier. <laughs> go ahead and unmark him. It's just the power 90, yeah. I'm uh, not there. I think I'm at like 50 or something. Maybe. It's probably being generous, honestly. Love that you can just hold left to automatically mount. Takes away a little, like, uh, a very tiny grievance from the first two is like open world none versions other. of the set. All it takes is one. His fist is a glorious basher of fools, full of great big scars and old dried blood. <laughs> one day. Oh, such a fine wallop it is. Anglo Saxon child. Little ones, what is this wallop you speak of? It's our grandfather. And be careful unless you want a wallop. Oh, I am they so talked about this quest also on the game his wallop. Many cowards have said the same. He uses only one fist, one wallop, boom, like a wolf howling with its knuckles. Well, this wallop has me curious. <laughs> Good. Destiny is coming to your plate. Great. <coughs> There's someone looking for a walloping. Hello. Yes, I have overwhelmingly powerful strength, but it is not worth talking about. If you are Dringa, we should tell stories of battle. Swill a cup of mead around the hearth, and share our wisdom. You want some wisdom? Don't become a hero like I have. I'm cursed with this wallop. These children have made me curious. Your calm demeanor even more so. Oh, I beg you, there's no need for this to go where I feel you think it should. <laughs> you best depart unless you desire your face become a fist cave. Children, stop saying such things. I do not want to use it. <laughs> I truly Kill me. wish to see this wall up. I will break it with my humble fists. Oh, neither of us will enjoy this, I'm afraid. He's gonna kick my ass. Oh, and so goes my day. <laughs> oh, never mind. I got the stun. Oh, nice. Down you go. Oh, I've never been bested before. I'm shocked. Stunned. I never thought it possible. You have thwarted my wallop. You may have access to the treasure my wallop has sadly gifted me over the years. Various awards for bashing skulls. Oh, I feel liberated of my legacy. Now I could live the normal life that has forever eluded me. Thank the heavens. That's nice. He is a send on to Angele and hate on him send on Marang Fultum. When they talked about this quest on the Game Informer show, uh, I guess Jojuba's just bad, you know? Uh, what he can do. No, <laughs> but he said he got his ass beat, like, immediately. And the guy really does have, like, a massive wallop. I'm sure if he had actually hit me, it would have went down one hit. Small scraps of parchment. Greetings, Werefrith. I challenge thee to a battle, however, it must take place on my great sacred hill. Here I will turn your one so-called wallop into a thousand fragments of dust that my hilltop will use as ant food. For nothing can stop me when I fight in my hilly kingdom. Sign the hill thane of Skiropesker. Salutations, friend of greatness. My name is known by none except the dead. I have killed whales and your fist is no whale. Let me cleave your head. I challenge thee. The scourge of Irviskire. Good day, fair-fisted Werefrith. Word travels as far as Wessex of your fist feet. Our faith would like to test your fist. Do you use that same fist to pray with? For she will answer it. Monks of Wessex. Yep, it seems uh, like a pain in the butt that I, you know, I have to deal with. I hope I get letters at my house from people who want to challenge me now. That'd be funny. Oh, here we go. That's the locked door. <laughs> the Death Charter of Wareforth the Walloper. Greetings to Elderam Wigmund and the nobles of the Shire. I, Werefirth, do entitle my second of kin the deeds to all of my land. They inherit the land I have kept under God's domain here in Grantabridge Shire. 
This writ confirms the passing of titles and land into their capable hands and out of my capable one hand. To them, a long life and great glory, I leave you in a friendly manner. <coughs> That's one of the guys I think that challenged him in the letter outside, right? The treasure he promised. His wallop won him an ocean of riches. Bag of adorned teeth is an ocean of riches. Sure. Children kept the collection of those he had walloped. Walloped. Okay. Love that the mysteries, uh, like the blue marks on the map, are just like really quick hits, you know? It'll take forever. Uh, no point in trying to fight that guy. So, honestly, I mean, I'm gonna come back down this way for these raids and stuff eventually. So, for now, maybe I just. Uh, go back up this way towards this other raid which means first I want this and then this uh, and I want to go there and I guess I'll stop at this gold one along the way oh, I want this artifact that's literally right next to the bird as well, or the fast travel point, I don't know why I call it the bird probably because the symbol's a bird, but still come on, come on noise just now that I, I think was a bird in the game. It sounded kind of like a compy though, and now I just want like Ubisoft to make an open world dinosaur game, you know. That would be nice. Just saying. <laughs> yep, climb in there, bud. You're doing it. You're really doing it. Oh, that's right. I think I chased this thing earlier and it got away. Why aren't you running? No, I definitely didn't chase this one, actually. Second. Second's not good enough though. Run better. Mashing the triangle button. There we go. Good lord. Okay, now let's get over to the boats. So glad I have the leap of faith now. Shark to scheme for the head. Coming for you, Raid. And then I gotta go back to base and see what I can upgrade. I can already probably upgrade some stuff, because I just completed a raid before we stopped the last stream. But I don't know exactly what, you know. You know what I'm trying. That was mildly horrifying. Over there's where I'm headed, but where are the boat? Like, there's the... Okay, that's that, so the boat should be right here. Well, the boats are right there, but what am I doing? I can just call my long shot. I'm not stupid. There we go. What are you doing, pal? First the gold. It's an enemy base or what do you think? Oh, so. yep. We're definitely looking at an enemy base. Whoops, that was terrible. Oh my god, I just threw my two arrows. How did that go with his head? 
Y'all saw that. It was ridiculous. I can't believe this is happening right now. Oh, I just lost, like, all my fucking arrows, which is, like, what most of my build is committed to. I should be fine, so... My longship's supporting me, that's nice. as well then. Oh, that is strong. Get a lot of locks on a single person, which is nice. Yes, there is some gear in here. I like it. I like gear. I like getting gear. Yeah, you're dead now. Sorry to be the bearer of bad news. Okay, yeah, they... they know I'm here. Oh. See you, nerd? Oh, he's still alive, but whatever. Where'd the other guy go? Oh, there he is. Hello. Gentle sir. Got him as he was falling in the water. Pretty sweet. You having some trouble there, pal? Okay there, pal? Boom, assassination. Jesus, guide my blows. Jesus will guide nothing. Who's got my key? Skill points for this. I'm gonna use it, damn it. That's more like it. Can't help you? Oh god, there's a lot of guys. Let's see me actually. Oh shit, I thought I got the block there. Oh, I'm facing the wrong way. That's what happened. Overkill! 666 damage, dude. Pretty sweet. Get them here. 
I need to go back up there and crawl through the window again. already upgraded to bronze so I probably should like not bother upgrading stuff since I'm gonna get stuff that's like already upgraded you know or maybe it doesn't even matter because maybe the stuff I get at the very near the very end of the game is already fully upgraded you know and it's like you've been saving your resources for nothing but I don't know increases attack after each hit up to 10 times I like that increases speed after each hit up to 10 times it is also bearded axe lowers everything well, slightly higher speed, barely. Lower weight too, though, which I don't really know what that does, but what if I do this? Oh, here we go, more speed. Increases the average speed of all weapon combos and attacks. Okay, so it does what you would expect. Or no, wait, sorry, that's not what I was looking for. I was looking for weight. What's weight? Increase how much stamina is consumed while dodging. Oh, interesting. Eh, I'll stick with my Varen's axe. They seem about even, honestly. Oh, snake. Hello. Hello, are you an enemy? You sure are. You're a lot of enemies, actually. Why is that not marked anymore? That's annoying. Kind of had to inlay into that first, but let's just let's just worry about getting the raid. Let's get my longboat back over here. Oh. I guess it's too close for me to call it just this, that small distance. Because this is already in use. Yeah. Weird, but okay. Oh, hello, Karine. Stop it! No, this is done. <laughs> this is not smart. I already got the item there. No, why did I push that button? Is this how Vikings raid? Y'all jump on the boat on the wrong side and swim across the river? Holy lord. Are you guys alive? <laughs> Why did you put the sail on? No, no more raiding right this second, thank you. Yeah, I'll take this path. It's like there's a mystery, like, literally right next to the... the viewpoint. A beautiful song. If I had had time to hear it. Too bad. Okay, there's just a quick mystery here. Oh, there's an artifact here too. What is it? Oh. No! Kidding me? How dare this game make sense? Uh, 
those the artifacts like right here oh there we go it's under the room roman artifact collected my head aches oh my god man joe juba mentioned a lot of quests now that i think about it because he also mentioned this one good warrior hi stranger excuse me i have a slight pain do you notice anything on my head? It's a, an itch or a cut that simply won't go away. It appears to be a, a battle scar. Ah, as I suspected. It must be from my most recent battle. You should see the other man. He got the worst of it. Worse than... I suppose it's possible, yes? If he's headless? My arms are numb from battle. Does it need any dressing? Do you think it is a serious wound? Good Drenga. You have an axe in your head. It is grim. I will take it out, but you will surely head off to the next realm soon. Ah. Valhalla it is. I appreciate your candid response. Now I prepare myself for the sights and sounds of the corpse hall. I will relieve you of the pain it gives you. Send you down the bee thrust. It is time. You know, there's a great mead hall nearby. We could go there and reflect on our greatest exploits. Nothing finer than an endless night of drunken glory. Make you forget all of the dishonorable fops in this world. Just scolds and warriors full of mead and stories. Is that how you pronounce Bifrost, by the way? Is Bifrost? Oh, yes. Let me weave you a hero saga from dirt and spit on This one blustery battle day, I was inside a shield wall. I'll listen to your stories, buddy. You're gonna die soon. So. Wife entered I'll the shield wall. You. Nude. <laughs> started singing. Oh, we were so young, so very nimble in our hugel and our ways. Okay, bud. All your enemies have been slain. Now you rejoice. <laughs> Poor guy. <clears throat> Ew. This area sucks. Swampy. Up we go to the viewpoint. Kind of cool seeing like Roman ruins and stuff. Very reminiscent of the Greek stuff all over Odyssey. Not quite the same, obviously. Oh, hello, your head is damaged, sir. Points. Oh, this is cool. Oh my god, that is super cool. You can see all the blues and the golds and the raids, which are reds, obviously. And you can also see, like, names of nearby areas, like the Abbey. One Deer, Earning Stone, Grant Bridge, Walden, Metal Tomb. Bristly Farm is the area that I'm going to go raid. That's really cool. First time I've seen that. I wish it would stop doing that. It's like something's seeing me and then not seeing me anymore, but nothing's actually seeing me so far as I can tell. And it just keeps doing it, and it's super annoying, honestly. <clears throat> kind of want to go hit that first, maybe? But nah, let's just go to the raid. 
in your longboat. What the hell is that? Okay, Mr. Long... Oh, there it is. Didn't exactly spawn close, did it? I mean, yeah, not the closest it could have. Spawned directly next to where we're gonna run ashore for the raid, so that's good. Oh, spawn backwards though. From the raid, anyways. Yeah, no. The thing that we're here to do. Let's go, boys. This is some cool animations. But did you just throw his axe at that thing? Uh, that was just a weird, weird looking interaction. Hello, we're here for your stuff. Oh, I don't want to completely miss that. How dare you. Eat it. He stuck that like under his armpit. What's but... my lead? Oh, the building is on fire already. That's good, I guess. I would like to get off of this building now. Oh, that blackish purple thing gives you adrenaline. Good lord. Hey! Can't do this. Let's bust alone. in here, the door's already on fire. Or the building's already on fire. Hey, take your sweet time, man. Give me a hand over here. Come on, friends. Buddy. Hello. Oh my god. <laughs> These raids are a little buggy. Give me a hand. Okay, bye Viking. Thanks for listening to me. Oh my god. Okay, what if I detach from it and then go back? Let's try it out. Hey, come here a moment. He is gonna help this time? Or are you just gonna walk in and out again? Oh my god. Quite buggy. Hold on. Hold on. This guy might be interested in helping. Oh. Come! Help me with this! Okay, this guy's interested in helping, right? Hello, you're right there. Oh my god, this is so dumb. 
don't don't even make this mechanic where like you wait for help if you, you help are not confident there. that you can make it work 100 percent of the time. This is ridiculous. Just watching these guys run in and out. Hey, come here. This is stupid. Well, hopefully when I come back to this one later, it works. Should be able to force open, but maybe I need to take care of some enemies first. Actually wants to help with something. Materials, arrows. You die now. Keep out of the marsh. She waits in the marsh, a cruel and ghastly wretch. To disturb her is to awaken a demon, one who will eat your soul. Stay away. Stay away. Somebody standing on it. Freaking idiots. Let's get in here, friends. There's a lot of enemies to kill in there. I'm not trying to kill civilians. Maybe they shouldn't be here while I'm fighting. Civilian casualties, like, not a thing in Origins and Odyssey. Maybe I'm misremembering. It's not like I went around killing civilians, so. Coming. Come on, bud. I thought we were gonna open this treasure. What happened? Get distracted. Still 
want that book. Just down below. Also, I think there's probably still some small treasures to claim. Yeah. I keep forgetting I can just like ping all of them. Okay, how do I get below? Flayor, not Flayor. <coughs> Gentlemen. Okay. Come in from the side down here or something to get to the bottom. I feel like that's this is probably not right. Treasure, so I may as well grab that real quick. They still have resources and stuff in them, just not as much as the big loots in the raids that you actually have to get, you know? I, we, uh, we don't have to keep burning everything, but just, you know, I know we're Vikings and everything, but. Money, money, money. It's like directly below this building, isn't it? Oh no, it's below this building over here. Okay, there's gotta be some way down somewhere in this hall. So scared. Everybody calm down. I'm here to help. Just tell me where the treasure is and everything will be fine. Look how my whole raiding party's still with me. I'm just looking for a freaking treasure. Maybe in here. Oh yeah, this looks good. We haven't been in here yet. Oh never mind. Excuse me. Sorry. Old pillow. Break that window. Oh yeah. Break that stained glass shit. Oh yeah, I ran along the wall down there. Not that long ago. Looking for an entrance to find this freaking thing. Um man, not a lot of Places left to look at that are directly next to it, anyway. Somewhere there's some way to get down. Oh, hold on, how about this? No, oh, no, nope. I distinctly remember already checking this. Did not seem like a good lead. My own man betraying me. Not really. The entrance is from somewhere down here. Am 
like really far away from it at this point though. I could use my bird. Oh, there's something. Maybe ping that. Could be good. Here we go. The cave, of course. Whoa, camera. Come down, buddy. Give me that ore. Oh, rats. Scary rats. yourself into the air and come crashing down. Sounds pretty sweet. Oh yeah, that's good. That's good stuff. Okay, where's it lead out of? Okay, so there was one door in this big area that went down there as well. Maybe it was locked before then. But I mean, I never even found the door, I don't think. Force this door open. I don't know why I would, though. Lots of plunder. Oh, yeah. I don't even have a uh, my crew here anymore. Cause they, they were like, eh, the raid's done. I'm gonna move on. Okay, let's go grab that one last treasure. And then we'll go back to base and see what we can build. Help! Help! Waka waka waka. Waka waka waka. Silver. You closed on me, door. Bastard. Okay, let's get back to. Where's my vice? There we go. Raventhorpe. I'm a blacksmith. Made a <clears throat> thing of your deeds and my craftsmanship. <laughs> okay, you can build the ship. The lot of shipyard to customize your longship. Carries wood shop helps fortify the settlement. Improves the feast buff. Hunwald and Swanborough house improves the feast buff. Cartographer offers maps that will pinpoint valuable items and resources you may have missed. A family-owned cattle farm proves the feast buff. Oh my god, there's so many. Close a place for Meta, feast buff. Farm the harvest and grow on the screen, feast buff. Use a shop to change your haircuts and tattoos. Okay, yeah, I need to get the stable going. Wait, it doesn't say how many resources any of this other stuff costs. Maybe I can't build any of that yet. Seer's Hut. Valka the Seer can help awaken your senses and delve into strange visions. She's not even allowed to be here yet, so that's weird. Boilers. Another house. Museum. Bring him Roman artifacts and he will reward you. Oh, nice. Farm. Hunter's Hut. Legendary animals. Trophies in exchange for rewards. Ooh, I do want that one because I already have a legendary animal trophy. 
brewery is where Tekla creates the finest ale on the land. Bakery is for feast buff. Here, by Idas will help you create your Joms Viking, who other players Jom Vikings and manage your crew. Okay, well that seems like a good place to start. Oh. Sure, are these things that I've found in the environment? Opportunities. Okay, this is the shipyard and the tattoo shop and stuff wasn't ah, even available for. With this, we can recruit more warriors. Now I can build the most vicious crew ever to sail the rivers of England. Sounds Our good. warriors now have a place to rest and train. A fine shelter it is. When word gets out, it should attract many Jomsvikinga to fight with us. Which reminds me, a few of your raiders are chomping at the bit in hope of becoming your second. You ought to pick one. Oh. Keep the generic one. Yeah, I don't have enough cool, like, customization stuff. Stay on the Hunnish bow. There we go. I want you to have a big ass axe, my friend. I assume he doesn't actually take this from your inventory, right? This is all just cosmetic. Did I give him the right thing? Sturdy Danax. Okay, yeah. He shouldn't even have that shield on, because he's not going to be using shield. Change gender, change appearance. Oops. Oh my god, it's just randomized. I like that guy that I had. No, give me back the bulky guy. There we go. Okay, sure. That's crazy, but sure. I don't really care. Sizing me up? You're my second, buddy. What now? Tell me about what you do here. If you want to deal with your raiders, you come through me. I'll make sure they're ready for you and keep them in fighting shape. All right, bring out my lieutenant. Okay, that's just a change. I would like to reorganize the crew. Huh. Interesting. I don't really have any problem with anybody that's in there. Good for now. I must be on my way now. I gotta play dice. Orlok, I'm interested. Yes, Orlok. Join me. Let us begin. Straight Let's into do it. the point. May the best hand win. I think I have three of those, like, god things now. <laughs> yeah, god favors. What's this one that I got? Takes off armor. That's actually pretty sweet. Depending on the situation. You get a lot of damage really quickly with that, actually. Yeah, if you roll a lot of uh, axes, obviously. I've already played a lot of it. Take the two helmets. That's it. That's not cool. 
Okay, I could use a shield. Ooh, nice. Steel, for sure. Yep. Just go with all that. He's stealing three from me right now, though. That's pretty lame. It's pretty lame of him to do. Just saying. No damage passing hands. God, he got all six, and he's stealing a bunch from me. That's pretty fucked up. Oh shit, he's got three as well. What does he have? The same ones I do, it looks like. Oh no. At least one of them is different. Two of them are different, it looks like. I'll have to look those in a second. As soon as it lets me move it over there. No, don't re-roll it. It fell in, you dipshit. Let's just go nutty on axes. I don't know. It's not like it's going to get me a finish, though. That's the thing. It's kind of like, what's the point, you know? One of my dice just, like, disappeared. That's weird. Am I only gonna roll three? No. Good. Yeah, I'll take the steel for sure. Just stacking up points for now. Oh, I still end up with three axes. You end up with no uh, armors, so that's good for me. Oh, I'm also taking three damage, though. Oh yeah, I want to look at his favors. He's got Thor Strike still. He's got ignore your arrows, ignore the opponent's shields. Which is the same, basically the same thing as I have. Heal health for each attack you block. Oh. That's kind of cool. Oh, is Thor striking me, bro? It's like, not cool at all. Actually, dealt eight to me and really had me on the ropes. Uh, this guy's rolling these thief things way too often. Pretty bullshit. Meanwhile, I have to just fucking take shields in order to be able to get any of these god favor tokens that he's just immediately stealing from me. Hmm. Ugh, learn how to roll, I work, good lord. Oh shit. Oh good. That worked out quite nicely. Okay, how much am I gonna have total? Four plus six, so I'm gonna have ten. So I could do the heal six health. But then he's gonna steal one, so I can't actually do it. Heal four health for seven. Which feels fine. Let's do that. Because I'm in real trouble right now. Except that he has a lot more God's favor than I do. And he has one more health, but that's not much. This will do. Why does he always get the steel with the border? Hey, I got it sent. got any damage through? Nope. You can see he got two of them, though. Like, oh yeah, I got one, but he got two. Which is good. Oh boy, he's gonna decimate me with that Thor's crap. Interesting. 
Yeah, he's just going hard on damage. He's going for the kill. Oh, what? Damn it, that is not what I fucking meant to do. I pushed X. Oh, of course. Just roll, roll as much damage as you need, friend. I hesitate to even go for the thief thing. I will, actually, though. Good lord. I'm in trouble. Oh, of course, they roll an extra shield. So I'm going to take three. And then he has enough to do the deal eight, which will kill me. So that's good. Oh, well, okay. He barely has enough? No, because he'll get one right now, too. So even though I'm stealing one, it's not going to be enough to keep him from dealing eight damage. One, two, three. Yeah, I'll end up at ten here, so... I feel like I have to do this. Yeah, he would have had lethal, but... Oh wait, who has higher priority though? His damage or my heal? I don't know. I guess we'll find out in a second. There, I mean, there was no other move I could make that would have been better anyways. His damage has priority. That's some bullshit. Yes. Ugh, utter defeat. Stings to lose so badly, does it not? Fancy another game? I'm not done yet. Let's begin. Cheater. I assume that's Tails. Sure. Take an extra thief. This will do. No, god damn it. I keep miss pushing buttons. I meant to keep that shield. It's actually a pretty good overall hand though. He's gonna take two damage, I'm gonna take three. steals they're still steals of course he continuously gets just gains and steals like I don't believe for a second that all the dice are the same in both of our pools so why can't I like switch out my dice like I can my gods you know I think that would be a cooler <clears throat> mechanic I mean his dice probably are the same as mine it just doesn't feel like it because he is always rolling the steal with the gain for honor or favor, whatever. Cool, that was not great at all. It's pretty terrible, actually. Just skip. Yeah, he is now just completely wrecking me. They're no fault of my own. It's just, you know. Maybe I don't like Warlog. It's pretty heavy on the lug. Playing luck-based things against an AI is never a good time. Ah, uh, not like this. What is going look on? Look at that! Here? Fucking look at that! Ridiculous. Unbelievable. Four steals. Three of them give him favor. That's unbelievable. This game some serious horse shit, man. So how many do I have right now? Six, seven, eight, nine. But then he's gonna steal, well, I'm gonna steal three and he's gonna steal four. So he's gonna steal one, so I'm gonna have eight. 
deal five damage, but I, I don't see a point in it. Just skip. So I may as well take that. Deep rolled all fucking three again. Oh, it just didn't take him that time because he's an idiot, but. There we go. Literally the only reason why I'm pulling way ahead this turn in terms of favor is because he's completely stupid. Uh, let's see, I'm gaining a shitload. I can actually, I can definitely do Thor Strike. He's doing Thor Strike as well. He's not gonna kill me with it though, right? Like, he's gonna deal one, and then he's gonna deal eight. Shit, maybe I should deal six health instead. Because I'm gonna deal zero. And then I'm gonna deal eight, and then he just has to deal one, which does not bode super well for me. I should probably just take this. Oh wait, what is he doing? He's not even gonna have enough, is he? And after I steal the three? Oh no, he's barely gonna have enough still. The end is nigh for you. That's what they all say, buddy. I have way less health than him right now. I do have quite a bit more favor though. I kind of feel like I should just keep taking all the favor. Interesting. Should have probably used that thief, but hey, you do you, buddy. Okay, so neither of us are getting any damage. I'm definitely gaining a lot more favor than he is, though. So how much do I have now? 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. And then I'm stealing 2 for 15, so I'll be down to 14. So I can definitely afford to do this. Let's do it. This will be over yeah. soon. Who's winning now, now buddy? Maybe let's just go aggro on axes and then I can just use this. Although I only have two right now anyway, so I don't know how smart that is realistically. I'll take a shield. I don't know if I should take these helmets, honestly. Because I have no idea how many axes he's going to roll or use. Go for a couple axes here. And I mean, it only costs two to take his two. If he gets two, you know, shields, helmets, whatever. Mm. God, that's something just for the favor. But no. Okay, he did get a helmet. No, 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 he's got three damage on me. I've got three damage on him, or two damage on him. Oh, can I, can I actually use that? Yes, yes, I can. So I think I win, right? Because I'm doing three. Yeah. Owie. I'm almost got you now. Uh -huh. Good 
game. The gods favored your hand today. Shall we go again? No. Another time, perhaps. I have not had the win all day. I must turn this around. You just beat me a moment ago, you dipshit. <clears throat> Good to see you. You'd like to speak? What is it you do here again? I buy and sell all manner of items. What's more, I am connected to a wide network of other traders. Meaning I have access. But I cannot do much of anything if I don't have a Yeah, yeah, yeah. You need me to build your ship. I get it. Until next time, Eivor. Don't think I can build a shop yet? Oh, no. Here we go. Is that what I want to do next? Trading posts is where you can purchase resources and unique items. Sure. Let's do it. to have a more permanent spot I've been saving these just for you we have talked so little since our first days Yanli and I know nothing about you how did you come to live in England I wish I had a more intriguing story for you I came from Sun Sao far from here for no real reason curiosity I suppose it is not an exotic story a young woman, excited by the prospect of travel, granted passage on a trading boat. Do you miss your home? Yes, often. I intend to return one day, or perhaps coax some friends and family to join me here. But I am in no hurry. Well, you're most welcome here. Oh, <laughs> I should soon have a few spices from the east to add to our feasts. As much as I love your hospitality, your food is... Mm. Well, you are doing your best. <laughs> okay. I would Word. like to see what you have in stock. Made from only the finest materials. So these... Oh yeah, these are unique items. That's good to know. Something to uh, save my money for. I assume these are not for sale anywhere else because they're unique, right? All gear is supposed to be unique in this game. As a friend... I wow, a bunch of cosmetic stuff, too. Wow, they, she has a lot of stuff. <laughs> Fantastic fishes and where to find them? Sure, I'll take that. You know yes, you so I won't be buying it. any more of these materials for a while. You should buy there's that. so much unique stuff to buy. I don't think I have a small boat yet. I should get that. A smart decision, Eivor. Shopping for the day? I have to go. Always a pleasure, Eivor. Oh, yeah, I have skill points. I think just two, right? Where was I heading? Oh, yeah, down the blue. I think I was trying to just unveil more trees, see what kind of stuff I could find. Sprint attack is not that exciting. Last chance healing. Oh, yeah, I'm mostly looking for more uh, adrenaline bars. Although I'm pretty bad right now about remembering to use my adrenaline to begin with. Emergency aim. Holding L2 will snap your aim to an enemy as they detect you. It's decent. Just take a light attack. Let's see. Inventory. Stealth headshot creates a sleep cloud around the body. Oh, that sounds great. Oh, it's a predator bow too. More attack and stun, slightly lower headshot, considerably lower speed, and higher weight. Still think overall better than the recurve bow, and I haven't even like boosted it or anything. It's a wolf as opposed to raven though, that, that's like a thing in your skill tree mostly, as far as I can tell. Uh, and then I bought Fine Greatsword. Just two handed, right? Yeah. Dork 
souls. No, that's just in here. I'll give this a shot for a while. I like it. I like that. Fury. Uh, let's see, what else did I want to build? Eight B. So, does it have the double thing around it if you actually can build it? No, that's already built, right? Yeah. Because there's a lot of stuff that, like, it was showing that I, I can't actually build. Yet. Stuff like I would like to build... Is this it? Is that the museum? The museum I'd really like to build. Oh, I don't even have enough supplies. Even if I did have access to building it, which I don't think I do. And then where's the one that's for animals? This one? No, that's a cattle farm. Here we go. It's right here. Don't have enough for that either. But, and it's apparently really close by, though. Is this it? It is. But yeah, I don't have enough materials. Can you remind me what you do here? When you hunt any animal, bring it here for a trade, and if you get something. That said, though, I can't do much until you build me a place to work. I was. Until okay. next time. Alright, what is this? A oh, landmark tree. Sage tree or a hangman tree? Let's do a hangman tree. Uh, I guess I'll just do the stable for now, since I can afford it. You really think Which is where? Can compare to Saga. You really think flighting can compare to sagas, to true poetry? Compare? I think it conquers it. It is quick, clever, accessible to all. It is the art of the masses. What is happening here? Holger wishes to prove that flighting is a lesser art. I am correcting him. It is unrefined, unpalatable, unpleasant. I could beat you without a lick of practice. That is not so, you thick-headed... <laughs> Eivor, care to judge a flighting? I would happily judge, brothers. Show me what you have. I will begin. <clears throat> There's a skin-deep resemblance twixt Holger and me. For inside, he's just hot air and bad poetry. Well, in all but our talent, we're certainly twins. It should be no surprise to see which of us wins. Not bad. Now hear this. <clears throat> you see, flighting is simple. So hearken to me. Look, anyone can do it. It's so easy. But the true challenge in life is to do something more. Like writing sagas, painting pictures, and, uh, and, um, lore. Yes, lore. There. What do you think, Eivor? Come on, not even close, dude. All this is the clear winner, Holger. I should have expected no less from you, Eivor. You have no ear for these things. A pity. Thank you, Eivor. Ubisoft, come down. Stop order. giving me your rewards. Okay, let's build this table. Stable and aviary. Tell me about what you do here. As a stable hand and a gameskeeper, I am happy to help you in any matter concerning your horses or your raven. How did you come to have such an affinity for horses, Rowan? They were my best friends growing up. I was a sickly boy with a stammer, and the horses were the only ones who never teased me. Over time, I suppose I came to understand them as well as you may understand people. I listen when they speak, and vice versa. May I see your stores? Animal trainers can be found near every large town and allow you to purchase and customize your animals. Okay, so these are literally just skins, right? So I don't really care that much. Else? Can we do a bit of training? Absolutely. 
Oh, training your mount will unlock new abilities and improve your riding experience. Oh, and it costs money. Okay. All mounts gain the ability to swim. Oh, that sounds nice. Stamina efficiency proved. Also nice. Health. Nice. I'll just take swimming. No, uh, you know, I'll take the stamina efficiency. For now you can ride. Well, Lots of stuff to spend silver on suddenly now that I'm actually building out my town. Until next Audio time. stop being That's a problem. A fine stable we have now. Lord, look at it. <laughs> What's that? Show me. That just sort my arms waking thing. Why is it sticking out so much? Let's go check it out. Oh yeah, that's my arms waking. Somebody summon him or something. Good day, Eivor. I'd gladly reave the swan road by your side, Eivor. Sfafa heard about your achievements and will be honored to join your clan. Yams Vikings are honorable warriors who follow a strict code of conduct, dedicating their lives to the fight. They will fight on your side as long as you can pay for their services. No thanks. My blade is always ready. With all the things I have to spend money on right now, I'm not super interested in spending money on that. Okay, so uh, where to next? I mean, honestly... So where, where's the story quest that we're supposed to be going to? Is that power level 20 still? I think it is. But don't remember where it is. Oh, it's all the way up here. Yeah, it is power level 20. All oh, this right here is power level 20. So I guess we just continue with story stuff for now. Let's grab whatever this is. And then, yeah, we'll, like, head over here and grab these and then head up here. You know, just start heading towards that story quest that we've already got accepted. But grab stuff along the way. Which, obviously, there's no way in hell we're getting all the way up there today with all the stops we're going to be making. But I'm going to be streaming this again tomorrow morning at 10 a.m., so uh, come on back for that. Unless you guys really want to see Demon Souls, that's the other game that I have not really touched. Um, well, and Miles Morales, I haven't touched, but I have to play that with my family, because they like the story of the first one, and they want to see this one, too. Plus, I think, you know, people don't want to see streams of Miles Morales, honestly, uh, unless they're just not going to be able to play the game or whatever. I think most people want to experience that firsthand. And if they've already experienced it, it's like, I don't really know what they're gaining by watching somebody play it. Feel free to correct me if I'm wrong on that, though. I think a lot of people are avoiding spoilers for this, too, though, which... I mean, I'm super spoiler-sensitive, so I get it. But generally speaking, I don't think spoilers in Assassin's Creed games, especially the open-world ones, are much of anything. Especially not if you're watching my stream, because I will spend 90% of the time running around. What is going on out here? Some kind of glitch in the system. Explore Anomaly. Oh, this is those things they were talking about where you can actually bring Kayla into the world. Bex, are Layla, you sorry. This? Yeah, it's weird. An anomaly of some kind. The rest of your simulation is frozen. I can see a loose data packet close by. I'll see if I could reach it. Okay, but take it slow. We don't know what this thing is. Hold for continuous pick or tap for separate moves. Oh, this is cool. Interesting little puzzle mechanics. Directors cast the light beam that will stabilize an unstable structure. I think I caught onto that.
make that jump? Okay. to manipulate the direction of the light beam passing through it. Ah, uh, I see. Okay. as a reflector, right? <laughs> yeah, so that one's a reflector. So I need to be able to get to it and then get back. So I want both of these pointed at it is what's going on here. Or no, 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 no. That's not right. I need this pointed at this so that I can move that without worry. This is a cool view, by the way. Of the simulation below. like this weird effect over it with the triangles and stuff. This is a polygons, I guess you would call them? I don't know. Okay, and then I can move that other one back to what it was on before. This music is a little too intense for what's happening on screen, but whatever. Closing in on the data packet. I see it. It's encrypted, but nothing I can't handle. I got the data. Hmm. Sending it now. That's some serious, like, first civilization shit that seemed to be going on there. I want more of that, please. It's not a bug, it's a feature. through here. So let's go ahead and highlight all these. I don't know what else is. Oh, that leads over to an area that I don't want to be in yet. But we'll like loop around there and hit all this. Okay, yeah, I only have three marked. That's good to know. Sensible. Uh, I think that's across the river. Kind of wishing I had gotten the uh, mounts can swim upgrade instead of the stamina efficiency. But I don't think I'll regret stamina efficiency either with how much terrain I'm going to be covering in this damn game. Uh, okay. Or I can, you know, not cover any terrain because the horse doesn't like this mountain. Horsey. Jumpy. Oh my god, fuck you. There you go, bud. You did it. Oh, hello. I forgot 
go upgrade my sword, but whatever. Do I have enough materials, by the way, for any of this stuff? I probably still haven't found any of the cloth or whatever. Oh man, I also just don't have enough leather either. Or in the case of this, close to enough iron. Like, that's the main reason why I don't want to do upgrades, I guess, is why not just save it for that, knowing that I'm probably just going to get a better weapon later. It's not going to give us supplies and stuff, but... <clears throat> oh, there's some treasure buried under the water there. Monkhut's there! Oh, was that why it was shining? Because I could raid. Must be... I feel like we already raided this. This path looks familiar. Maybe, maybe I'm wrong. Oh, I think that, yeah, this was this, the raid they forced me to do earlier. Yeah. <laughs> Whoops. Cancel the raid! Cancel the raid, everybody. It's over. The jig is up. I guess this is the closest one now. Hmm. But it's not, it doesn't work with the idea. Well, I guess it works with looping around. I'll just end up back in the longship. That works out pretty well, actually. Hopefully they uh, cancel the raid. Can I cancel the raid? Myself? No. Don't be silly. <whistles> Gotta remember to call them out when I'm just running. Okay, good. They finally canceled the raid. Yeah. Oh, please don't. Yeah. Careful, please. This leaf cannot fall. Stay back. Do not touch this tree. All right. What is your name? May. Eivor. Something about this tree important to you? It's the leaves. My father said he would return home before they'd all fallen to the ground. And now, only one remains. And still no return. It's been six weeks. Six weeks since he's gone to Lincoln in search of work. I wish he stayed. Just one more season. He was so sure the fields wouldn't yield, but we could have tried. Your father sounds like an honest man. Went looking for work to take care of you. He would make every effort to return home. And that is reason enough to hope. But this... It serves no purpose to fret like you are. Then what should I do? Carry on. As if he were to return tomorrow. No matter what happens to this leaf. Yes. Yes, I shall do as you say. My father would want the same. Thank you, Eivor. Maybe... Maybe I'll wait just a little bit longer, till the goats begin to bray, or... Yes, a little longer. Hmm. That quest is still gonna sit there, though. Maybe I go to Lincoln at some point and I can find her father? Until then, that's just gonna sit there. Because, like, uh, these... But, like, the weird thing is there aren't really side quests. There are. Oops. I did not mean to do that. There are side quests, but there's uh, stuff like this, the Ravensthorpe stuff. I don't even know if that's really side quests. I think that might be main quests. Just uh, not, a, not as, like, prescient, I guess. But, like, this stuff does not pop up in your quest tracker. So it's kind of weird that I just have to leave it until the, some undisclosed point in the future, and I... Uh, I will just have to remember. Oh, yeah, that's the one where I need to go to Lincoln, I guess. Probably, maybe. Sorry, lady, I destroyed your door. 
May's journal. It has now been six weeks and father has not returned home from Lincoln. Home before our tree sheds its last leaf, he told me. But every day I peer outside there are more leaves on the ground and less in the trees. Sometimes I do not look at all for fear the tree by our home is bare. But then I am struck by the hope I may see him riding over the fields back to me. Oh, father, where are you? Do something to the goats. She says she was gonna wait until the goats did something or other. I don't know. These aren't even goats, these are sheep. I mean, I can't speak with her anymore or anything, so. I guess let's head off to the gold for now. Try to remember that that's something I cannot interact with yet. up the horsey. Assassination! I forgot I thought that already. Oh, that's interesting. The second one doesn't count as a melee kill because you throw your axe into their head, so you have to loot them. genetics with the 94 bits. Corgo. Thank you for the 94 bits, genetics. Oh, Lord. Well, that didn't work out as stealthily at all. Well, don't throw stones at me. Ability. It's just really good single target damage, if nothing else. Boom. Oof. Have you played much more Valhalla Genetics? Are you trying to wait until you can get your hands on a Series X? Because of them damn load times. where the treasure was? Okay, I guess I grabbed the treasure. Of course, a couple more treasures pop up over there, but you know what? I can probably grab those when I go to do, like, that raid or whatever. Let's just loop back around and then loop up here. Like I was originally planning. I see a bunny. Now it's a dead bunny. Sorry, bunny. friend i think you may have eaten something that did not agree with you today my saga is ripped glory, glory. ah a brave steed has swept me up onward to my loyal companion if i don't stop him supplies in there or someone less forgiving will i should stay close by wait for him to tire you tired yet buddy 
throw up. I may throw up. <sighs> Fight me! You will be honored to add to my legend! I hate that rabbit I killed. He was levitating a little bit. Oh. Am uh, I crying? It's a good thing I already cleared out this camp, because he would have caused some trouble. This area is off limits. I have the strength of 1,000 Thors! You keep this up, you're going to get yourself killed. Are you hearing me? Yeah! Loud and clear! Now stand aside so that I may fulfill my destiny! Yeah! I have the strength of one thousand... I'm going to have to drag you back myself, huh? I think I can no longer walk. Yes, it appears so. Okay. Oops. If my mother could see me now. Pick him back up. <clears throat> my saga is Am complete, right and it is the envy of all Did who really came before, meters? and all yeah, I who so. are yet to come. Hello, little foxy. There is no resisting this lasting legacy I have forged. A wise man said it best. To resist is to piss in the wind. Sure. I have been struck. Your skull. Gods. Is he dead? No, but he should be. Seems the gods disagree this time. Splash water in his face and keep your distance. You will throw up something fierce. Thank you for the advice and for your trouble, which is now my problem. <sighs> Completed saga. Okay, uh, let's head back to the boat. I guess the boat. Can be. Oh, I can fast travel to the boat? That's good to know. Monastery! Over there! Mm, yeah, we already raided this one. And then we attempted to raid it another time, so. Let's just calm down on the raids. On this particular monastery, friends. No, turn. Let the sail loose! Oh, I'm gonna crash. Uh... Sail out! Sea loose! One more Roman runes. As well. Oh, hello. It's one of these guys. He's freaking out. Just Psycon is freaking out. Can I not tag him? Okay, there we go. Okay, these are the zealots on the side. Yeah, they're also just at power 90, the ones that I'm finding, so still need to avoid this one as well. Guessing there's a Roman uh, artifact somewhere in here for the museum when I eventually get that open. <laughs> Must be what the artifact is, wherever the hell that went to. Okay. It's up higher. Oh, there's enemies up there too. Snakes, maybe? No, looks like a guy. A couple guys. Best not I think to they own attention. the ruins. <laughs> Keep climbing, bud. 
You can do it. Damn it. Oh, come on. Oh, fuck you. Just drop down then. Where can I actually climb up? Oh, here we go. My stun attack. Quickly. Oh, yeah, that's good shit. There's my ruined treasure. Or artifact, or whatever the hell. Whatever you want to say. That was a weird ass sound. So there's some gear there. Guessing I have to go through that entrance to get to the gear. There's a couple of treasures as well. Which I assume are normal treasures, considering I'm already, like, grabbing a gear right there, you know? Oh, there's a place to jump off over there. I'll say it's higher up though. Okay, but it's like inside of that. Yeah, and it's locked, so probably have to go through one of these two entrances. You an enemy? No. Smart man. This looks promising. Treasure hunters know, I am calling a cease to my search. There is no treasure here. I must have searched every inch of this grotto, top to bottom. Someone removed it ages ago. I'm certain of it. Maybe I'll return and have a look with a sober eye next time, but I doubt it will make much difference. I don't like how I can skid with a torch in sand. What a pro. Take a look at that treasure map. Where would that be? Oh, here's where your quests are, I guess. Interesting. Hmm. Collectibles, trade goods. <clears throat> oh, here we go. Treasure horde maps. <clears throat> Read this one. Uh, it's on like a little island off to the side. I don't know. I don't usually end up following those, honestly. They've been in the games for a while, and they're, like, kind of fun to follow every once in a while. The riddle ones are the main ones that I don't, just don't bother with after doing, like, one. Because they're interesting and fun, but they take too long and reward too little. When I say too little, I mean essentially nothing. Ooh, there's a book hidden somewhere in here, too.
I think there were three secret entrances, right? There's the one right here. Watch out for snakes, as always. Oh boy, definitely gonna need a torch in here. Take it slow. Snake. Oh, never mind. I knew it. Do you think me a fool? Let's wait back after I get that book. Just go down, but in the water. That fire burns. Why does it burn? Skill book. Harpoon impalement. That sounds wonderful. Hail enemy with your harpoon and throw them in any direction using the stick. Enemies who strike objects or other enemies will suffer massive damage. Yes. Yes. Is there a reason to shoot this? Probably not. I'm going to do it. There we go. That was a weird angle that it gave me for a second there. for the book. Now I gotta figure out how to get that piece of gear. Also, I gotta remember how I got in here. Oh, there's a ladder that I walked right next to. Faster, Eivor, faster! Oh man, now I'm discovering all sorts of stuff all around here. That's what I'm talking about. I want to find these treasures and obviously grab the viewpoint. There's a like regular treasure. Okay, this is not going to get me into it. It'll get me a vision of it. But it won't get me into it. Same thing. Second verse. Same as first. Okay, it's either a way up to it or down to it. Probably down to it, from up here. Here we go, oh no. That's silly of me to think that I was doing it. Hello. Here we go, we gotta blow that up somehow. suppose just hitting it is gonna work. Also, I don't know that I even have an ability that's just gonna hit it. Is that freaking guy back? Yeah. Jackass. Oh, here we go. This is what I need to. Give me that 
that treasure. Okay, let's see if this. Oh yeah, that's right, carbon ingots. Which those are what you use to actually upgrade your stuff, like at the camp, and I think that's all they're used for. So I shouldn't really hesitate to upgrade at the camp. The thing that I should maybe hesitate to upgrade is in this menu, like with the like here, because that costs iron and leather, which I need for these upgrades. Uh, before I worry about just upgrading my weapons that are doing fine damage, anyways, you know. Still gotta figure out how to get that gear. And I still gotta climb up to this thing of a bopper. It's gonna climb around the side. He went out on the last one, but okay. I think it was just too wide. Uh over at that like little mini bandit camp. cannot believe that we've been streaming for two hours. Time passes by so ridiculously quickly playing this freaking game. Okay, there's only two entrances. I don't know why I thought I saw three. That might, like, that gear might have something to do with that treasure map that I got earlier. What are you doing, buddy? Cool. Cool and good. Yeah, don't jump into the hay or anything. There's an enemy guarding it. A couple of enemies guarding it. Oh, shit. That guy's nearby again. Door's locked. Maybe there is just a way in through this little bandit camp over here. No. They're just like claiming ownership over the treasure, I guess. They already have the door locked. I don't feel like that's necessary, but whatever. Can try and enter from the top. See if that's anything. not. Yeah, I definitely feel like... Oh, shit, is someone seeing me? Oh, no. Hmm. I feel like this might be... Like, because it's so close to this, I feel like it might be connected to the treasure horde map thing. What's that other treasure horde map that I have? That was way back there. Oh, yeah, that one was actually a riddle. Uh, Leda, let, let, let us cess to Shire horde map. Looks like you cross, like, a river. Or, no, oh, okay, so it's showing the X on, like, the island, and then the X on, like, a little rock. I mean, am I even in Ledesta Shire, or is it just, uh, I don't know, I am in Ledesta Shire. I wish I could just bring up that map instantly. Okay, so it's shaped, um, like a chicken nuggets. <laughs> I don't know. The island that I'm looking for. It looks like it's a flat bottom. Okay, so it is on here. Looks like it was around here, probably, maybe? No, remove all those. I'm just kidding. I still want to ping on this, though. There's a little treasure over there. Um, let's see if that seems about right. I 
I don't know if I can keep those if I stop playing them and start playing again. So it's like right before the uh, on the divot, or uh, the, the, what's the opposite of a divot? I don't know. So I guess yeah, right around there seems about right, or up there maybe. Well, whatever. I don't think it's for this um, outfit in that case though. <clears throat> Must be blocked from the other side. But then again, I don't see how else I would get in here either. I want the trip. I want this treasure before I stop playing. Is there maybe a window that's open? It's a window there, kind of window, but it's definitely locked. window right there. Again, super locked. Oh. Is that? No, that's blocked too. Kind of looked like an opening for a second. No such luck. Zunin, guide me. I swear from the bird I could see another like entrance to ruins from somewhere around here, but clearly not. Clearly I'm fucking crazy. Ooh, these treasures are legit. Super hard to get to. Like, I skipped a couple back in Norway as well that I couldn't quite figure out how to get to. But they weren't gear. This is gear. I want the gear. Gentlemen, I'm here. Open the door. The fuck is that? Oh, it's pig. It's horrified me for a second. I need to get on the other side. Am I kind of just calling one of my buddies to come knock it down with me, you know? That would sure be smarter. We are Vikings, you know? Just saying. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to find an entrance on this thing. No matter how many times I circle it, I'm like an idiot. <laughs> well, I don't know. I'm at a loss. Like, I can check out where that treasure map was leading. Let's see if that's anything. We may as well do that real quick before we end. <clears throat> Oops. Damn it, I didn't mean to use another heal. Just trying to call my freaking mount. Okay. Don't mount it. Might as well grab this chest. Or treasure, whatever treasure it may be. Oh, that was cool. That animation. Honey, I'm home. Oh, thank you. Yeah. I knew it wasn't that just that like exact area. I need to let's see you look friend. around here. Look around, look around. Been listening to my Hamilton lately. Oh, 
Here we go. Right there. Here. Oh, nope, there's a treasure though. Okay, that's so that is you definitely need a map to be able to get that treasure at all. It's just super hidden. What did I get? Snake bite scheme for shields. Oh, cosmetic. Cool. Does not help me get that gear back there, that's for sure. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna fast travel back here. And uh I guess tomorrow when we start up we will immediately try to figure out how to get that gear. Or maybe we'll just move on. I don't know. We'll make that decision tomorrow at 10 a.m. Pacific time. What's our power level? 40. God, we are not anywhere near the 90 that we need to go to another area yet, but we've got a lot of this area left to explore. And I think there was another area that was just power 20. Yeah, this area down here. There's still a lot of that to explore, too. And there's a main quest down there. After I finish this main quest up here, there's a lot to explore and suggested power level 20. So the next power level, oh, and I'm actually really close to 55 already, which lets me explore all of East Anglia over there. I thought there was a suggested power level 90. Oh, yeah, there it is. Just loomed in. Okay, Oxen, Forshire as well, yeah. Yeah, we're, we're progressing very nicely at a good pace. <clears throat> Anyways. Uh, oh, okay, here we go. Quit the title screen, yes. Thank you, everybody, for coming. Victorian Genetics, I know you were here. Anybody who was lurking, appreciate it. Uh, tomorrow, I'll be streaming at 10 a.m., from 10 a.m. to 12 p.m. Pacific time. That's my new time frame for Thursdays, just to make sure that I always have time on Thursday nights to record the Splunkers podcast, and then immediately after I record it, I can start editing it, which is very nice. Um, and that is... Uh, that's uh, We're not actually recording this week, just to be clear. And we are actually recording on Wednesdays an awful lot lately because of the scheduling conflicts. Like the PS5 releasing this past Thursday. And the next Thursday is Thanksgiving. So not a good day for everyone to record. And Thursday, two weeks after that, when we will be recording again, is uh, the Game Awards. Which we might be doing a live reactions to. We're still talking about it. Uh, so that, yeah, we're actually recording on Wednesdays right now. So my time switch is a little odd. Uh, it doesn't really line up well, but... I like streaming in the morning on Thursdays anyway, so stop judging me, okay? I will see you guys tomorrow for Assassin's Creed Valhalla at 10 a.m. If you can't watch me in the morning, totally understandable. I will be streaming uh, on Friday evening at my normal time. So come join me then. Bye. Thank you.